We are completing a patrol of the neutral zone border, no Alpha Oneus 3. There have been no incidents other than a brief run in with the Federation warship Dominion. I fired a plasma torpedo, intentionally missing their hull by only a few meters. I am told it is a traditional intimidation tactic. They backed away like the puny worms that they are. We've completed our routine checks on all seven neutral zone outposts and are preparing to return to Romulus for a much needed leave. Commander, the crew is assembled for morning review. Excellent. As soon as I complete... Red alert. Red alert. All hands to battle stations. Scanning this asteroid field for useful elements when we were suddenly attacked. I gave you a simple task. A simple task of looking at this asteroid field and this is how you repay me? Perhaps I see an airlock in your future. We were just about to send for you. We've been fired upon by three ships of unknown origin. We suspect they may be a newly discovered race. The Vancians. The Whatians? The Vancians. Known for their extreme aggression and their proclivity for wearing strange hooded uniforms. Never heard of them. How dangerous can they be? Commander, shields at 67%. Initiating evasive maneuvers. What? No! Stand your ground! Fire at will. Take no prisoners. Leave no survivors. Concentrate fire to that cruiser on our starboard. Transfer power to our port shield. Continuous fire. Commander, their shields are failing. Excellent. You attacked the wrong ship today, my friend. Finish them. Concentrate fire on that battleship. Commander, shields are at 21%. Let's distance ourselves from that battleship. Transfer all power to aft shields. Fire torpedoes at will from all launchers. Keep that battleship at a comfortable distance. Commander, the cruiser is within transporter range of Iota Pavonis 2. Commander, our warp drive is damaged. It will be down for at least three cycles. Well, engineering, they have half a cycle to get it up and running. Commander, the cruiser has transported an assault team to the surface. They will most certainly attack our research facility on the planet. Field Privates to lay in. I want your orders. 
Send a team to the surface immediately and defend that research station. For the glory of the Praetor. Scans indicate they're getting power for the weapons intradimensional. There. I've isolated the frequency. This one's mine. Send down my Lerpa.
now to see the face of our enemy. For the glory of the praetor! For the glory of the praetor! Another full salvo. Commander, our torpedoes are doing minimal damage. Disruptors are equally as ineffective. The battleship's defenses are not like the cruisers. They are using some type of phase technology. It dissipates our weapon's effectiveness. The dissipating effect has its limits but we are having difficulty overcoming it. Shall I commence evasive maneuvers, Commander? No, stand your ground. The response team must have a ship to return to. We can withstand them. Commander, should I retrieve your ceremonial death cloak? No, there will be no ceremonial death cloak. We must not think of death this day. We must resolve. No failure. But if death should come, this ship, our bodies, they may be destroyed, but our spirits will live on to the glory of the Praetor. To the glory of the Praetor. Masate, I know that perhaps there have been times that I've been, well, less than pleasant to you. But I just want you to know, Ed, if we fail today, you've been an exemplary officer and a loyal friend. Commander, incoming communication. On screen. Captain Robert Tack of the USS Constitution. Can we be of assistance? Starfleet. You seem disappointed. Who were you expecting? McLeod, take care of that. Aye, sir. Commander. Jew Devaro. Commander Devaro, I realize our governments have not been on the friendliest of terms, but I'm not likely to stand by for an unfair fight. May we be of assistance? Yes, you may. In that case, Commander, please keep communications open, if you don't mind. Captain, shields are at 93%. Fire full spread. Let's see if we can take him down a peg or two. Any specific part of the ship? The ship is a complete unknown. Commander Navarro, have you found any weakness in their defenses? No, Captain. I've not seen shields like this. Our weapons dissipate before even doing any serious damage. They're using some sort of phase technology. Phase shields? That's an interesting innovation. We need to find a way to overwhelm their ability to short off our weapons. How about a coordinated attack? Indeed. Weapons, prepare fire. Ready when you are, Captain. Orders provided to show a power fluctuation. Commander Navarro, we just sent you a set of coordinates. Falls in your court. Receive and... Ready when you are, Captain. Locking target. Fire. Tap. Fire again.
That worked better than I thought. Granted, Dorboro, may we be of further assistance? I think I can handle it from here, Starfleet. Leave the area immediately. Your presence is no longer required. No good deed goes on what I stop. You know it, sir. Tavaro, out. Next so, you have the con. Sir? Mr. Desmond, would you please send the last engagement to my personal terminal? I need to file murder for Starfleet, and the sooner the better. This is going to be a head scratcher. team all accounted for? Yes, Commander. One casualty, the rest are aboard. And the research station? Nominal. Good. Helm, set a course for Helm. We are in need of much repair. Mazate? Yes, Commander. I'm in need of a light meal and a hot bath. Commander. Yes, Mazate? Thank you for your kind words earlier. They, they mean a lot to me. Kind words? Exemplary officer. Trusted companion. I never said such a thing. Yes, Commander. Commander. Incoming communication from High Command. Entree. I am told that you have sustained severe damage. You were entrusted with a brand new, state-of-the-art, and very expensive ship. There should be no damage. What are we to do with you, Commander? Admiral, in a cowardly fashion, a new hostile race got in a couple of lucky shots. We destroyed one of their cruisers and sent two running home to their mothers. They will not be so lucky next time, should they show their faces again. Hmm. Very well. I shall inspect the damage myself. Report to the nearest space dock. For the glory of the crater. There were no other ships in the vicinity. There was the Valdor, and there was the three other ships of unknown origin. Is that understood? The glory of the Praetor. The glory of the Praetor. Captain's Log, Stardate 
After our skirmish with the interdimensional beings, we have undergone minor repairs at Starbase K-9. Meanwhile, the crew have been enjoying a few well-earned days of r and I'll admit, we would have had a tough time going up against their ships without the aid of the Romulans. They could be a force to be reckoned with in the future. But for now, we have been ordered to transport Starfleet's newest captain to the USS Dominion. I'm looking forward to seeing my old friend, Jason Brousseau, again. I've heard a lot about her. You've never met her? No, I haven't. So she has an interesting and varied career path. One of the few captains that has come from the medical services. I've heard nothing but good things about her. I expect one day she'll be coming for my job. <laughs> She's ready, Captain. Bring her aboard, Chief. Yes, sir. Energizing. Welcome aboard, Captain Farrell. Thanks for the lift, Captain Tacking. Now, let's not keep an old friend white. Don't fight, don't die. Don't die, don't die, don't die. 